hello. Today, to celebrate reaching 1 million subscribers, we are going to Silamay. We're risking our lives. You're a much better vlogger than I am. Uh, yes. Our day started at the Talon bus station. Soon we boarded our bus and we were on our way. Where are we? No, now we're in Silamai. You ready to explore? Yes. I'm so excited. Before we explore, here is a little history. After World War II, Silame was used to extract uranium oxide from the surrounding oil shale. In 1952, the mining stopped, but Silame still processed uranium imported from elsewhere. In 1982, reactor-grade enriched uranium was produced in Silame. Because of the secrecy and security that went along with uranium and anything nuclear during the Cold War, Silame was a closed city. Okay, let's explore. Still was having some shutter issues, so uh, check out my previous videos if you're curious about that. It's really, why are you running? <laughs> well, it wasn't green when I started running. How do you know? Fuck you. <laughs> Bird, don't give up. Can't you tell? I'm so fit. It's insane. Well, this area is not that bad. What? This part's not that bad. What kind of benches do you think those are? Soviet. Checking behind you. <laughs> Our first goal of the day was the Monument to Atomic Power, reminding us of Silame's nuclear past.
Then, the famous Merepuiste, a pedestrian street built in the Stalinist neoclassical style. Plus, I think it's for old people, yeah. Look at that balcony. It doesn't even have a door to go, like, inside. Weird. Hey, we're on, what, C Avenue? Yeah. Metafuya, sure. Well, some weird shit just happened with my film camera, and I don't want to deal with it right now, so... I see people going into the store, camera. but never coming out. We need some clothes. We slowly made our way towards the sea. It's just outrageous how sick you are. I stepped on some grass to take a photo. I think so. For me. It's the royal bench. Does it like here like this every day? Eat grapes, drink wine. Then it was on to the seafront promenade. It's an egg. Oh, 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 Good boy. Oh, there's another one. That's also mine. And there's a whale. Public group barbecue and equipment. Like talent? Like straw me. We 
found a place to sit and I got my, my film camera issues sorted out. Then we made our way to the museum. Seagull Street. <laughs> I'm sorry. We're trying to find the museum, but uh, this does not. Well, this probably is not the museum. Okay, pulled up Google Maps. We're on the right path because it's right there. It was closing in 10 minutes, so we just checked out the gift shop. There was a small Soviet garden outside of the museum, though. So I forgot to change this film speed in my meter, which I specifically asked Maria to remind me to do well, you know when I changed my shit. film. So this was already like. So all, all of these film, all of these previous photos are going to be underexposed, but this one might be properly exposed. I pushed the film a bit in development, so the previous photos were salvageable. Hello. Why'd you do that? I just said hello. Oh, I know, yeah. I should have said that I. Nah, you should have said Privyet. Korot Narva. Korot Silame. Why so angry? The cat. Because it saw you? Well, it saw that pro cat handler and the cat body language expert. It was time to find some place to eat and have a beer. They think you're friends, yeah, no. You, you cheered. When we first saw this place, we couldn't tell if it was open because it looked quite dark inside. But we crept in to be greeted by a very small space and a group of people who just immediately stopped talking once we entered. That was awkward enough, but then we checked out the menu and Maria started to order for us. I oh, started Wait. speaking some fucking In mixed, mixed language, like uh, dva, dva shashlik, pork. <laughs> and I did Russian accent. I said pork. And he's just like, please order in English. Oh, God. So I'm like, okay, I'll order in English. Well, the menu was in Estonian. I know. The menu was in Estonian, so I figured Maria would order for us in Estonian. But, oh well. Like, very touristic. You know, take photos of our food. Oh yeah, me not walking around with two fucking cameras strapped to me doesn't make us look like a tourist. Or me having a fucking stroke. The food was good. So how, how, how was our meal? It was 
so good. Yeah. See that my Ruski going on. Шашлик, порк. We didn't want to wander too far from the bus stop, so instead of more exploring, we went to have another beer. With a slight buzz, we headed to the bus stop. I built, built the entire city of Tilomae. You can read, I can't read. I'm not gonna read. You can read, I can't read, I can't see, I can only listen. I want to be safe. I'm doing drugs right now. Please. Okay, I, I turned it off. I stopped recording. Oh. Oh. What is that? Are we live? We're live for our millions of subscribers. For our millions of subscribers, support us on Patreon. So how how is how was our time? Uh, with... There's a link down below to buy merch. Okay. How was our time in Sila May? Sila May. May. I bet it was great for you. It wasn't great for you. Hello, subscribers. Look at my beard. Then the bus arrived. And Mario took a nap. We rode the bus back to Tallinn and that's it. Until next time.